Okay, I wanted to show everybody a, a quick little protein source that is in extreme abundance in certain areas of the country. If you walk around here in Arkansas in, in dry or moist woods, uh, you will find, especially in the spring and summertime, that you get tons and tons of lizards. I mean, they are absolutely everywhere, and they're a good protein source. Uh, you can catch them fairly quickly. You got to be a little bit wily. There's certain techniques that you can use that work. Never let them get near a tree. Once they get on the ground, you chase them down, you know, either whack them with a, a, a long stick with some, some branches on them to keep them from moving too much, kind of stun them. Um, or if you can trap them in a spot and just, you know, hit them with your feet, that's a, that's a pretty decent method too. But the second they get on a tree, you're done. I mean, they, they're, they're so fast and, uh, you know, they'll do spirals. It's, they're almost as fast as a cat up a tree, so don't let them do that. Um, but I want to demonstrate you basically, you can eat these things whole as they are. Just take a sharpened stick and uh, run it through the backside, and we're going to roast this thing in the fire. You want to make sure you cook the heck out of it. Um, all reptiles, for the most part, uh, can have diseases and parasites and things like that. But that doesn't mean that they're not a really good protein source as long as they're cooked well. So I'm going to roast this thing over the fire for about, uh, you know, maybe five minutes and uh, have a lizard shish kebab, and we'll come back. Thanks. All right, so I've let this set out over the fire, making sure that it's really well cooked for at least about 10 minutes. Um, like I, I mentioned, uh, any kind of, anytime you're eating a reptile, you want to make sure you cook it good, and obviously let it cool off before you eat it. But, uh, you know, this highly abundant protein source, not something you're going to want to pass up after a few days of uh, not having any, any decent food. But uh, you just eat them whole, bones and all. You don't have to gut them, none of that. Don't waste your time with it. Just, just uh, it's just that simple. It's not, real cr not as crunchy as you think with all the bones and whatnot. And... Um, few of these will keep you going for quite a while, so. Tail's mostly bone. So, in the early mornings, it's one of the best times to catch these things because, you know, all, all reptiles are cold-blooded, and they typically are a little bit uh, less active, um, you know, before the sun comes up. So you can go and turn over logs, and um, a lot of the times they'll be really cool, and they won't move as fast. And you can smack them with a stick, whatever it takes to get them. So just keep that in mind. And um, we uh, appreciate the, any commentary you might leave. And uh, please help support us by subscribing. And uh, check in for the next video. Thanks.